Hello there, my name is Mr. Smart Donkey. Welcome back to my display of Fallout 4. So the last time we left off, we were back in Sanctuary. We get we go here a lot, don't we? I'm just gonna drop off all my crap real quick. Uh, shouldn't be too difficult. All of these guns, basically anything that isn't favorited right now, can just go. You can just go fuck off this cage armor right now. I actually want to um, that one too. I probably want to just. Uh, Get rid of those. Salvage them is the word I'm looking for. Pocket it. Scrap that. Because that probably... Oh, the other one actually can't be scrapped. Well, never mind then. Let's get out of here. Let's drop that off in here as well. Oh. Nope. That, get me out of here. All right. Drop off that cage armor then. Uh, store. I nearly pressed take all. That would have been terrible. Would have spent the next half an hour. Actually, I would have just reloaded, I guess. 164, we're still so heavy. I mean, we've got so holy shit, we have a lot of food on us. I didn't realize it was that much. I probably should actually drop some of it. These weigh 0.5 each, are you kidding me? Store all of them. Yeah, that, that saves me quite a bit of trouble. Oh my god, I didn't realize that was that much. Just those things alone. I should drop off a lot more of the food, but I... I oh my god, it's going to take absolutely forever to do all that. Uh, like all the drugs I could probably drop. They don't really weigh anything, though. I guess I should drop some of the food that, like, yeah, this cram. Like, this is 0.5, and it actually adds a bunch of red, so I'd rather not use it unless I have to anyway. All the things that weigh, weigh 0.5, and I have s tons of them. Like, these ones are good, because they give me rad resist, so I'll keep those on me. Uh, these, like, I can make into the baked bloat fly, so I probably shouldn't get rid of those. Canned dog food, that's not very good. Dog meat never eats so these aren't very good. These weigh one. That's a state. That's 185 health and one agility buff. So I want to keep that on me. Dirty water I can make into better food. They don't weigh very much. These grilled. These are pure healing. So I want to keep those on me. Uh, this I will sell at some point. Let's just actually. That's so terrible. Yeah, let's drop it off. Insta mash. These can all go away. Weight one. That's pretty bad. Myrolurg me, that's... actually that's... I can probably cook that at some point. Why is it... it looks like, like it looks like it's in a tin or something. That's weird. These are pure healing. Even though they weigh quite a bit, they're pure healing, so I don't really want to drop those. Um, Nuka Cherry, Nuka Cola, I don't really need that right now. They, they weigh quite a bit as well. Let's just drop those off as well. Pork and beans, yep. Yeah, this is saving us a lot. This is pure healing, and I mean, they're pretty heavy, but I'll keep those on me. Rad resistance right away. Minus 400 rads, okay, so I definitely don't want to use it easily. Um, Roasted steak, that's good stuff. Salisbury steak, that can go. Squirrel on the sticks, pure healing. Sugar bombs, they can go. Tara berry, they don't weigh anything. These potato flowers, yeah, they can go. Um, see, this is already, like, we're down a ton of weight, and that's just a bunch of eight that I dropped off, so that's good. Oh, I have some junk, really? I thought I already pressed the, uh, store all junk button. Oh, there you go. Now it's done it again. Okay, cool. Right, uh, so now that we are not very heavy, let me quickly check out what's my... Can I see 114 out of 143? So I assume... That means we have 29 rats. Is that how that works? I don't know. I don't want to use a like a rat away. If it gets rid of 400, that sounds like I could get rid of a lot. That seems a bit like too much. Like you know, if I only have 29 rats and I use a minus 400 thing, it seems kind of pointless. I don't think it's exactly minus 29 though. I think it's more than that. But I have no idea how I figure that out. Anyway, it's time to finally do what we were going to do. Which is to go to Concord and start looting the area, because we hadn't really done that yet. My amazing defense is right here. I could fast travel there, but we I was going to enter from this side, because there was a little house there I wanted to go into right away. So tired. Dog meat. Keeping up. No? Alright, that's exactly what I wanted. Can I pick up these tires? No, I can't. Now that I know I can pick stuff up, I want to pick everything up. I really thought they took it out of the game. 
but I guess not. There's probably nothing there actually. I was going to check it out, but nah. Oh, is that dog meat? Yes, it is. Oh, what is this? Are we being stopped halfway there? Again, because I found something. Can I for once just not find something? More red than. <sighs> Alright. May as well go into this more red than. Then, then, yes, that, that sounds better. Unless there's tons of rats down here, in that case I'll skip it. Brain fungus, no idea what it does when I'm taking it. Oh, we nearly were unhidden there for a sec, there must be something there. That's a terrible weapon to use here, I'm not sure what I'm thinking. There you go, that's the first mole rat. Jesus fuck! Could you not though? I mean you can you can sneak up on me, alright, but not like that. Jesus fuck. Just not just, just, just don't do it again, man. Fuck you up. I mean I already killed you, but I'd actually heard about this place. I don't know what this place is, but I heard about it. It looks very irradiated, so I'm surprised I'm not seeing any plus rads right now. Cause the moment I do I might just get the hell out of here, cause probably can't handle that. Um, I'm not getting any right now though, which makes me think there might not be any at all. I mean, that literally has the fucking rat symbol on it. Oh yeah, there we go. Alright, let's um... Let's put on our gas mask, throw it on a quick save. We're still getting it. Fusion core, that's worth it. Mr. Benson, on behalf of the Boston Regional Office, I would like to congratulate you and your team on winning the two, 20, 2076 Trash Busters Award for the greatest year-to-year -year waste reduction by a single store. Respect for the environment is an inter integral part of our corporate image, and we appreciate your innovative, in innovative efforts in this regard. Sincerely, G Gerard Phillips, Vice President from the Boston Region. 2mm pistol, some rounds. Oh, just give me a ton of rats for no reason. Oh, still getting it. There we go. Yeah, I've got a feeling I won't be able to just walk in here and start looting this place. I could use a rad X or a rad away after all this. There's some over there or something. I hear them. I hear them, man. I swear it. Coolant. Let's take that. Cause I don't think I've picked that up before. Give me all your shite. Flip lighter I saw somewhere. Those are always good. Can't find it anymore though. Plunger, fuck it. Take that as well. Left arm bones. You know what, I'm gonna take that. I wanna know if that's, like, what, what the hell we get from that. I also wonder how much this brain fungus weighs, because I might just be, like, overloading myself for no reason. That, look at that, that's like, like a heat source. Is that like super irradiation or something? I wonder what that means. You want on a stick. Oh, it doesn't mean anything to do with radiation anyway. Yeah, you can keep your broom. Flip lighter, there we go. I think what I read about this is that there is a fusion core here. But yeah, we already picked that up. I hope there's something else here as well. Brain fungus. Let's have a look at the brain fungus. I don't even know what it is. Is it in here? It is. It weighs 0.1 each, so that's not alright. That's not too bad. I might be able to make something from it. Okay, so there's only one more place to go then. That's where we came from. There we go. We've been in there. We've been in there. Actually, more brain fungus there, but I'm not too bothered. Not with the risk of radiation. Tons of it. There's a safe there. What the fuck is that? Glowing mole rat. Shit. I would have liked to have gotten a nice double damage on him. Don't don't dive. Don't do it. 
Go on, mess him up. Alright. He's gonna probably give me some radiation, I imagine. Okay, I think that probably was the last one. That I've got a feeling this is a very small area. Could you not, dog meat? Please. Uh, Alright, I'll take all that. Just gotta hope there's something useful. Oh, there's a teddy bear in there. Yeah, let's not drink that water. I've got a nasty feeling we don't want to do that. Irradiated blood. Nuclear material. Oh, it's novice. I was expecting it not to be any harder than that, though, because this is an early area. Well, I'll still open it, of course. Hardest novice lock ever. Got it. Got it. Compensated light 10 millimeter pistol. Pocketed hardened later. Raider left arm. That's pretty heavy, actually. I wonder if they put that here on purpose, like a slightly better 10 millimeters. Like, if people find this area, it's like, yeah, this is a great area for starting. I mean, it is obviously. You probably don't want to sit there, dog meat. I also don't know how you name him, or how you rename him. Still, someone told me you can armor him up as well, and I mean, I knew I I could do that. I just don't know how. I mean, you can give him a, a, a dog tag, which makes me assume that you can. But yeah, I haven't actually seen how yet. We can actually just run out of here now. That was a very small area. And we didn't pick up that much stuff. We're not too heavy, so... I'll probably just continue. So we were going to this house. My god, is this fucking Silent Hill or something? What's going on? Can't see anything. And the gun becomes really, like, pixelated. I saw that... I said that last episode or the one before. I think it was two episodes ago. Becomes really weird, like pixelated looking in this. in this weird, like foggy area. Cap stash, don't mind if I doodly do. Ooh, a Nuka Cola Quantum. I'm pretty sure I've been told those are ridiculously sick in this game. Nuka Cola Quantum. Yeah, they heal for 400. And 100 AP, right? Or, uh, whereas the regular Nuka Cola heals for 20 and 10 AP, so it's 20 times as good. Well, 20 times the HP, uh, 10 times the AP. But that's pretty darn good. So I think they're sugar bombs, even though I just found out they're actually not that good. This is just yeah, the outside. Okay. Nice TV in here. Let's go upstairs. Let us check out the upstairs area. I meant that some buff out. Nice. Red bandana. A bobby pin. Don't mind if I do. Welding goggles, we already have those. Ooh, bobby pin box seven. Yeah, an advanced one. Well, I would have preferred an expert since we can do that now. Yes. Compensated calibrated 10 millimeter pistol. We got a lot of 10 millimeter pistols here. Let's see which one is actually the best one. I assume the one we're using right now is the best one. Uh, so, this one is 20 damage. That's already worse. 21, 71, 72 are the most important things. The one we're using is 26, 119, 74. So that's much better. This, one, this is a really good one, though. And then there's a compensated one. Let's compare these two. Okay, it is better than that one. Let's actually just equip this for a second so it's easier. Minus, minus, minus. Okay. It's not as good. We'll let that be clear. I think that was just dog meat going for the fucking door again. Man, when I can get a new companion, I will immediately do that. I think there's a guy called Valentine you can get in Diamond City, but I, I, I'm not expecting to get to Diamond City anytime soon, the way I'm playing the game right now. Um, I mean, if you look at... We've played what... Let's see... Nearly 10 hours now? Yeah, pretty close. Um, and then if you look at... This is Diamond... No, wait. This is Diamond City. We've done this so far. So, yeah. I don't think I'll be getting there anytime soon. And it's the next part of the main mission as well, which is the best thing. Okay, this is boarded up. I don't think we can go in here. Nope. I like that, though. Because, I mean, it's not... And it's not like, oh, yes, it's great. There's a house we can't go into, but more... In a way that it it means we can't like explore every single house, so it's not going to take a, a 
fucking decade to explore one town. So all the houses that you can explore will, will be meaningful to explore, basically. Uh, we explored that house, I remember that, because we came in from the other side. We can't actually go in here, I thought we could, because this is, like, open, but I guess not. Well, let's stick to the road. Because of the fucking fog, I can't really tell where we're going and stuff, so it's actually going to be kind of... Like, I like to do this methodically. But it's going to be hard if I don't know where I am and what I've seen before because of the stupid fog. Yeah, it looks like a diner of some sort. Motorcycle. This fucking fog. Going down this alley here, is that? No. I thought I saw it. it. What the fuck was that? Did you walk into a trap or something? What the hell did you do? Did you just fall and die? What the fuck are you doing? You're crazy, dog meat. I mean, you're a good companion and all, but the moment I can drop you, I fucking will. I keep still forgetting as well that I can actually give him stuff so he can carry shit for me. I'm just not thinking about it. So I keep going back to drop stuff instead of giving it to him so he can carry it for me. But then again, probably it's even more of a hassle constantly switching items between me, his infantry, my infantry, and fucking other things as well. This town is pretty large, but it looks like most of these houses are actually boarded up. I'm trying to stick to the outside for now. This house is also boarded up, isn't it? Yeah. It's going to be very hard to tell where I've been and where I haven't, though. I think that's the church. Yeah, it is. That probably... I assume we're going to be able to get into the church. That would make sense. What's this, though? Stimpak. Fusion cells. Don't mind if I do. Minuteman outfit. He's a Minuteman. Oh, would have been cool if he had some kind of item on him that I could have brought back to uh, Garrett or whatever his name is. I'm like, yeah, I found a Minuteman in Concord. Is he one of yours? Oi. His name was Fred. He is one of the good guys. We've looked for him for days, but we never found him. Seems he didn't get away from that quest we sent him on. Something, something like, something like that. Okay, there's obviously been something going on here. This is, uh, oh, this is, inf okay, that's, that's the building. Right, so I want to go in here still, because we, we were in there very shortly, but I don't think I ever really got to look around. We've never been in here, though. But we've definitely been next door. These are dead, right? Yeah, these are all the skeletons. Skellingtons. Fucking hell. Could you not? Please, scare the shit out of me. I hate getting... the poop scared out of me. Yeah, you're sitting on a book there. Burnt textbook. Oh, it's probably not very useful. I imagine I can't even read it. Burnt... textbook. Not readable. Drop that shit. No one wants that. I was I was expecting something to be here though. Maybe upstairs. There's no way this church area is gonna be completely empty and void of anything useful. I don't believe that. I don't believe a word you're saying. I heard something moving, but once again it's probably our fucking short pipe rifle. It's probably our good friend, dog meat. Ah, expert. Yes, we're being rewarded. But before I do that, I want to see this gun we just picked up. Uh, short pipe rifle. So this is a rifle. That's not a pistol. Uses the same ammo, obviously. It's not as good, though. Hmm. I don't think I'll be using that. Alright, let's unlock this. Nice. Nice. 
Nice. Nice. We're getting pretty good on, uh, we're doing pretty good on 10 millimeter ammo, I think, I think as well now. Yeah, 331. We actually have more than we do of for this gun. But the damage between the guns at this point is only four difference as well. So it's not like we're really wasting our time using this gun. In fact, the range is actually better. Fire rate's better. Accuracy is slightly lower. And damage, of course, is quite a bit lower. But I'm not going to switch away from this gun because the ammo is still more common for this thing. We've just been using it so much that obviously we're running out a little faster than the other gun. It makes sense. It all makes sense. There's something going on there. But the fact that I fired two shots just now and nothing happened means that I'm not too worried about finding any enemies here. Okay, there's never mind. It's nothing. I thought it was a person, perhaps. I wouldn't be surprised also if Dogmeat all of a sudden screams of pain again because he's fallen off something. Ah. Hmm. I assume I've looked at that because that's where we found. That's where you get the uh, power armor suit and you jump down there. Somewhat surprising there's nothing here. Hmm. I assume I can jump back up. Oh fuck, I'm not sure if I can actually. Please? Yeah, I can. Alright, let's go down then. Let's quick save it before I do anything now. I've got a feeling there's nothing here, but you never know, you might be get re might get rewarded for some exploration here. No. No, I didn't think so. I'm not surprised. Now the real question is... Can I make that ridiculous jump? And the answer is... Hell no. But then the question is, am I gonna try anyway? And the answer is, hell yeah! That didn't work. The question is, are we surprised? The answer is no. No, we're not. Alright. Now my character's gonna say no. Nah. Again, for the longest time, because that's obviously a bug. Okay, well, I'm happy with what we found. We got a bunch of ammo, a bunch of other stuff. Nothing, like, I would have liked finding a note here or something. Maybe something about what happened to these people, or that, like, I don't know, something. But, uh, you can't have it all, can you? Alright, let's go into this little area here. There's probably, yeah, there's tons of these pipe pistols and stuff around, because I was quite full when I was last here, so I never actually got a chance to pick everything up. We're definitely able to pick more up right now. Take the duct tape, hard hats. Actually worth having a look at how good that is. It's not very good at all. Let's drop it. Also, let's put that back on. Ah. Any ammo boxes or something hidden here, perhaps? No. This is nothing, really. I thought there was like electrical circuits or something. Light bulbs, they might have something in them. Maybe if I reload it, I'll stop saying nah. Nope, still says nah. Power relay coil combination wrench, sure, why not? Is that a screwdriver? Oh yeah, I think he was he had that in his hand and I knocked it out when I was outside. Or knocked it off. Okay, let's go upstairs. Hello. Milady. Oh, Mad X and Psycho. Alrighty then. What are you hiding here? Nothing? No. Well, I mean, that was alright. Just getting two of those drug fingers, that's not bad. Cool. Another place. I can't help but feel like there must be something up here, but... Nah. There wouldn't be. Okay. Another place explored. Now, obviously, we've been in there. We've explored all that. We've been in... There. But, is there anything else here? Is that... Open... Oh, well, let's go in here first. Ooh, first aid, always good. Literally, always. Every single time. It's good. Ammo box. Also quite good. Shotgun shells. 
That was some pretty good ammo right there as well. Oh, this is a safe expert. Man, we are getting well rewarded for this. I'm glad I came back now. Really? Okay, I didn't find a single place where I could have actually come. There we go. Oh, shit. It's gonna be annoying. There we go. Yes. That's 27 bobby pens. Pins. Uh, bayoneted light pipe rifle. Not very good. We still have plenty of weight though. Letter left arm. I'm gonna leave that in there. Wonder glue. Very necessary in weapon upgrades as far as I remember. There might have been a expert locked thing in the Museum of uh, Freedom. That's one that I may have forgotten. Looks like we might be able to go in there as well, actually. Uh, so we we came from there. We went around there and went outside. We didn't go in here, did we? But I don't think there's anything there. But what about this? Yeah, this is not somewhere you can go in. Because it, you can look how shitty the textures are, like inside. It's like they didn't really bother, because people they didn't think people would look, like even look in there. I guess. Oh. Alright, let's go in here if there is a, an in here, which it looks like there's not actually. Nope. We've been in... That house or something? We've been in one of that- no, this one. Yeah, we've been in here. We came from over here, I think. Yeah, because we came- we were in that house. When we first got here. We've been up there. I don't think there was a house to go in there though. We just like we we went up there. I think we found a shotgun there or something. Okay, let's check out this house over here. One Nuka Cola. Don't mind if I doodly do. Pretty sure hiding is not necessary, but again, we're not really that much slower with doing this. Cap stash. Not bad. Anything else? Oh, an outside bit. There may have actually one day been a corpse up there, but since we, since it doesn't like save the corpses, that they probably disappeared. Can we actually? Uh, I guess we can't actually get up there. There's probably nothing up there. Oh, right. He didn't stand up when I told him to. That's why he didn't let me do anything. It doesn't even let me jump. Ah, fuck it. I'm not gonna take. I'm not gonna waste my time on that. It. Can't go through there. Oh, there might be something in here. Subway token. Well, the uh, air is cleared up. Look at how beautiful the game looks like this. I really like how it looks when, like, when it's nice and sunny out. It's so colorful, like compared to Fallout 3 and stuff. They went for that, of course, on purpose. But it's it's just so nice. It's such a massive change from Fallout 3. Yeah, this place is gonna hold some treasures, I just feel it. I feel it in my fingers. I feel it in my toes. Oh god, so far it's not really... Prove <laughs> it's really proving me wrong so far. But then there was a safe in the wall. No, this literally has nothing in it. Okay, that's very disappointing. I was expecting it, like, I'm at least some crap, maybe, like some tin cans lying around or something. But no, this 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 is just like, nah, mate, you're not getting any f anything from us right now. Okay, so done that. We've been in here, and this is where we run around to the right, and we come up again or up to that museum of uh, of stuff, freedom or whatever it was. And there might be more. This looks, yeah, I can go in there. This might be one of the last houses. Did my hidden meter just change? I'm not sure if it did. It may have done. Ooh, that's a nice place to look at later. Doc Anderson. Hmm. Yeah, we nearly weren't hidden there anymore for a second. 
I feel like those people are probably friendly, but still. That'll be a nice thing to talk, or a nice people to talk to next time. After I've explored this house, I'll probably end the episode. Oh, hello. Pipe bolt action sniper rifle. I don't think we had something like that yet. Cap stash. Big cola bottles. I, I mean, we've had like rifles of a sort, but I don't think we had a bolt, like a bolt action sniper rifle yet. That's. I don't remember that name. We are still quite good on uh, inventory space, actually. Okay, that's that. Quickly want to see if there's anything, I mean, any more houses that I can tell. Those are both closed off. Uh, there might be, like, one over here, perhaps. There's a Nuka cola machine there. I'm pretty sure those people aren't going to go anywhere. This looks like you can actually go into it, actually. Workhouse. I may have already been in there, but I don't remember. Yeah, I think I... Yeah, this is that house that I exited from this side. Yeah, I've been in here. These are... Both closed. That's closed. So yeah, I'm pretty sure I've been in here every, uh, in all these houses now. There is still the Museum of Freedom where there might be... Uh, an expert locked box there, but I don't remember. And I'm not sure if I'm going to waste my time going back in there. I might do next time. I'll talk to these people anyway. I want to see what they're all about. They're probably friendly, I imagine. Can I look in there? No, I don't think so. I imagine they're friendly. Settler. Yeah, these guys are going to be friendly. But I'll talk to them next time. So I'm going to leave it there. Thank you guys for watching once again. Hope you enjoyed. Next time I'm going to talk to them. Uh, maybe go back into the Museum of Freedom. Hopefully they'll give us a quest we can do. That'll be cool. Like something in their neighborhood, perhaps. If anything, there's going to be a bunch of stuff to loot there as well, so that'll look good. Anyway, until next time, have a good day and goodbye.